Hey guys, welcome to Diecast Reviews. Today we're doing a review on Holiday Hotshot Lightning McQueen, the Thailand version of Holiday Hotshot Lightning McQueen. Uh, released obviously in 2021, um, just in the regular series. Uh, so honestly, I think it, it's it, to some extent there's some good in them going to this regular series because we're getting some cars we wouldn't have gotten otherwise, like the Holiday McQueen. We would have. Uh, gotten if they were still doing just regular series only on and only during the christmas period uh the easter buggy and the easter mcqueen uh those ones uh we probably would have only gotten during the easter season so um there is some good to them going just to this uh no series version uh no series packaging i guess uh, and we get these cards that we wouldn't have gotten uh otherwise uh just during the year so uh, yeah, Holiday Hotshot Ling McQueen has been released a few times before. I'm seeing metal. Uh, so not a new release, but the first Thailand release of Holiday Hotshot Ling McQueen. Along with uh, Holiday Cruiser M Ramon, I think that's his name. Uh, also the first time he's been released from Thailand. You can see some other cars on the back of the package here. 2020 Mattel. Obviously, early 2021 release. Um... And yeah, he's uh, been released from China. He was released, I think, 2009 originally. I think then he was re-released in, like, 2013. I think this is the 2013 re-release version, although there's no date stamp. I don't, I'm almost positive this was in, like, the uh, this was the 2013 re-release version um, of McQueen, but he still has that mouth plate. This one doesn't have a mouth plate, which I kind of want to... So that's why I'm opening this one up, kind of compare it. And uh, the non-mouth plate version, obviously, is better. So let's get him out of the package here. So here is Holiday Hotshot Lightning McQueen out of the package. And uh, he does look very, very nice from well, from Thailand. And uh, yeah, let's take a look at him. So obviously this bright metallic cherry red paint that he has, which looks very, very nice. Can't really be metallic red on the Transforming Light McQueen Super Chase. Uh, this one is very nice indeed. Um, similar to that one, and uh, yeah, very nice indeed, and it kind of obviously spans all over his body. Uh, then we go to the side here, he's got the, uh, just the regular white wall tires, which look very nice as well. Obviously, his lightning bolt kind of is green now, and it's kind of supposed to represent a Christmas tree. You can see it, I guess, kind of, but yeah, kind of, you know, obviously works for what they're trying to go with. Red and green works for the Christmas spirit, uh, Christmas look, I guess. Um, go to the back, nothing really, just some stickers for taillights, so they're painted, but you know, representing stickers for taillights. You see nothing, no Rusty's logos or anything, just red and green. Uh, there you can see his eyes, they do kind of look a little weird, that's, I'll give, uh, I'll give China the, uh, Props on this one. You can see the eyes are actually metallic as well. Here they're not. They're just this like dark red color. So they kind of look a little strange. But there you go. No mouth plate though. So that's nice. Nice smile. Nice expression. I really like the expression on this McQueen actually. Very like calm, relaxed expression. Very, very nice. Take a look at the base here. N35 is when it was produced. Uh, made in Thailand, obviously. Um... Yeah, this one's obviously made in China, and, like, there's no date stamp that, like, I can, like, uh, decipher, I guess. Uh, that's the date stamp, but I'm not sure how to, like, tell what those mean, but I'm almost positive that's a, a 2013 release. What's sometimes interesting on, like, these metallic versions, or even just these cars sometimes, is that down here, they don't get painted. Because when the car's coming across like this on the, uh, paint, uh, like, when they paint it, the bottom here doesn't get painted sometimes, so you, it kind of looks just like bare metal down there, um. Uh, maybe Zaymac or whatever, but if you, like, rub your hand along, it's kind of rough along the end. Just kind of interesting, honestly. Uh, get a peek of what the, uh, underneath the car is, I guess, or whatever, but, uh, yeah. That's, uh, that's more of a Thailand issue. That hasn't, uh, really happened before. I've only started noticing on Thailand releases, you can see. Here. 
Uh, but anyways, that's not specific for this McQueen. That's happened on others in his run. I don't, I don't even think that's specific to McQueen, although I've noticed it a lot on McQueen's. But uh, let's compare him to the China version. Obviously, the big thing is you can see the mouth plate on the China version right here. Um, and uh, it just doesn't look good. The crack just doesn't look good. So having a no mouth plate version of Holly Hotshot McQueen, definitely very nice. Uh, yeah, I like that a lot. Other than that, the two seem to be pretty similar. Uh, basically identical, actually. Um, I really, the, the paint, the paint looks very similar as well. Actually, the Thailand one may be a little more metallicized, but it could be just the, uh, could just be the lighting. I'm not sure. Um, obviously the eyes, I do give the props to China on the eyes. But, um, other than that, yeah, they're basically identical. Really is no, no difference. The green on the uh, side actually is a little different. You can see it's a little darker on the uh, China version, a little lighter on the Thailand version. That's kind of interesting that they changed that. Um, that's a, that's a, that's a pretty noticeable difference in my opinion. Uh, the uh, green on the side, that's a pretty noticeable difference. Because like the red, if it is different, I can't really tell. But the green, you can definitely tell that the green is two different colors. That's, that's quite a big difference actually on the uh, green there. Um, maybe Thailand. I don't know. I don't know why they changed the color. The white looks a little less bold as well, I guess. I definitely a little less bold. The uh, tree itself looks a little smaller. You can see, yeah, the tree is definitely smaller. You can see how the tree went up to like the back here on the uh, China version, up to the window here. It doesn't go up to the window. It goes up to right there. Here, this one just barely goes up to the uh, spoiler right there. They definitely made the tree smaller. Um, I'm not sure why, but, uh, yeah, they definitely made it smaller. Very, very interesting, actually. That's a very interesting uh, thing that I didn't think we were gonna see. But, uh, this Holiday Hotshot version of McQueen's pretty cool, but my favorite version, uh, this one right here, uh, with the, I don't think this had a different name. I think this may be just called Snowplow McQueen or something like that. Um, but, yeah, I like it, obviously, with the, uh, like, monster tire wheels here, the Snowplow in the front, uh, you've got the lights on the roof here. Nice detail on the snowplow and the tires. Nice detail on the tires. Really nice detail on the tires. Um, so yeah, that's my favorite version of the uh, Christmas McQueen. Is this one here. Also made in China. And also, I think, a 2013 re-release. Although, actually, the dates are different. Um, so maybe this, maybe they were released in different, different times. But um, Also, a re-release. This is not the original version, I don't think. Uh, no, definitely not the original version. A re-release of the uh, Christmas of this uh, McQueen. Because I think he was first released in 20, 2009. So this is a re-release. Whenever they were re-released. Um, but yeah, this is my favorite version of the Christmas McQueen. Between these two, uh, let me know which one is your favorite between these two. But uh, yeah, this one's definitely mine. Definitely a very unique McQueen. So, uh, let's give Holiday Hotshot Lady McQueen a ride on the turntable here. Let's hope he doesn't drive away. Uh, so yeah, uh, that should do it for my review on Holiday Hotshot Lightning McQueen. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit the like button, subscribe, share, comment, all that good stuff. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.